Hello, my name is Martin and today I would like to present to you three lessons by Alex Webb. In 1974, only 22 years old Alex Webb became a Magnum Photos nominee. He began his work as a professional photojournalist working for the New York Times magazine, Geo, Life, National Geographic and many more. Alex became a full member of Magnum Photos in 1979 as a 27 years old. Alex Webb is best known for his complex and saturated color photography of happy coincidences or epic moments, often in places with social political challenges in society. Past 45 years, Webb has worked in places such as United States at Mexico border, Haiti, Istanbul, and just now he started to document a number of cities in the United States. Alex is working mostly in Latin America and the Caribbean. He admired those cultures which has inspired his work with color, but he transitioned back from black and white photography in 1979. Webb has published 17 photography books, including The Suffering of Light, a survey of 30 years of his color photography, A Memory City with poet and photographer Rebecca Norris Webb, his wife and creative partner, and his most recent books include La Calle, Photographs from Mexico, and the collaboration Slant Rhymes and Brooklyn, the city within, both with Rebecca. His work is greatly internationally recognized. He has received many awards and grants. Free lessons by Alex Webb. I only know how to approach a place by walking. For what does a street photographer do but walk and watch and wait and talk and then watch and wait some more, trying to remain confident that an unexpected, the unknown or the secret heart of the known awaits just around the corner. Alex Webb. Find someone to share your passion. Yes, I know, this is quite unusual, but very important one. Alex is always talking about how passion and obsession with photography is making big difference in a way what you will achieve. But not all paths are easy to walk alone. He and his wife Rebecca Norris Webb, who is a poet and photographer, and have been with Alex now for over 30 years. Just notice that in every interview with Alex, he will mention her right at the beginning and when someone asks about the projects, he say, me and Rebecca, my life and creative partner, we work on this and that, we went there. Their passion is nourishing each other's. They work like a team, even if they have their careers separated. Just check their official Instagram or website, they are a team and every single one of their projects is simply amazing, even more when they combine their talents together. Go, just go and inspire yourself. Layer photographs and fill the frame. You might have heard about filling the frame so you get subjects in your foreground, midground and background. This technique is very popular and very rewarding. The world is full of complex life and scenes and amazing stories. It would be a shame to separate it. But this technique is also very complicated and if done wrong, it leads to messy photographs. Alex is, by my opinion and opinion of many others, the best photographer who uses layering in such a perfect and unique way. He puts order in chaos, sense in a way of looking at all elements at once. Just slow down, observe and wait until all the elements come together. Listen to the street, smell it, and think of how you can bring this vibrant life that you see right now to your photographs. Lead your viewers into photographs through and then out of them. Shoot intuitively and embrace the failure. Luck, or perhaps serendipity, plays a big role. But you never know what's going to happen. And what is the most exciting is when the utterly unexpected happens. And you manage to be there at the right place at the right time and push the shutter at the right moment. Most of the time it doesn't work out that way. This kind of photography is 99.9% .9 about failure. Alex Webb Out there there is so many things going on which are out of your control. Rather than being discouraged by it, embrace the fact that you can feel this world and wait for the moment, right moment for where your subject, light and moment align in a great masterpiece. When Alex goes to the streets, he doesn't plan what, where, how, he's going on an adventure. 
His only plan is to be surprised and be ready to capture it. My work is questioning and exploratory, he says. I believe in photographs that convey a certain level of ambiguity, that ask questions rather than provide answers. Alex Webb. With Alex's work, I feel like he's not even looking for answers. He let the world speak. So the best what we can do is at least listen. Thank you very much guys today for being here with me and uh, share work of this great master photographer. Honestly, this is one of my favorite, all-time favorite photographers and I hope uh, he became one of yours too and you can be inspired by him. In the description down below I will put some of the important links for uh, Alexis and Rebecca's work, for their page and even for some interviews uh, which I found on YouTube. Thank you very much for your attention and have a nice day.